Hi Junior and Teen Families, my name is Alice and I usually work with the little guys, so some of your guys' younger siblings, on the other side of Rave, but today I am going to be talking to you guys about one of my favorite hobbies, which is roller skating. So I don't know any of you guys know how to roller skate or if you've ever been to Roller Kingdom or have gone rollerblading or anything like that, but it's a super, super fun hobby and I'm so excited to share it with you guys. So I'm gonna start off by showing you guys my roller skates. They're right here, they have this cool strap that makes them really easy for me to carry them around on my shoulder. But these are my roller skates, so as you guys can see, they're black and they have these cool pink wheels. I bought these at the beginning of this last year, so I've gotten some pretty good use out of them. Um, but as you guys can see, they're this cool like suede material and this is how you stop. You use this toe stop and you just put your toes down and you come to a stop. Um, and so yeah, they're, they're super cool. So these, um, as you guys can see, go all the way up to like my, above my ankle. And I have a second pair of roller skates that I use for something different. So these, can you guys see the difference in these roller skates? Yeah, so these are my roller derby skates. So I joined a roller derby team at the beginning of the year and then obviously we, we didn't get to play but these are my roller derby skates and I'm super excited for when we can go back to playing sports again. Um, so yeah, as you guys can see they're a lot lower, um, the wheels are really hard because you use them indoors. When you're outdoors you use squishier wheels. Um, so these are my super cool roller derby skates. So when I go roller skating, I go to the roller skating rink, I go to the skate park, I go on nearby trails. So you guys might have wondered what this little thing that looks like a dog bone is. It is um, a slider. So it's used to slide on metal rails. So I don't know if any of you guys have been to a skate park or like on scootering or skateboard yourself, but there's rails and you can kind of like slide across them. So I just started getting into that, so that's super fun. Um, and what else do you need when you go roller skating? We need all of our protective gear, right? Because I don't want to get hurt, because that means I wouldn't be able to come to work and see you guys. So, this is my helmet. As you guys can see, it is super sparkly. Um, I want to see if I can get it in the light. Oh, it's super, super, super sparkly, which I love, um, but yeah, this keeps my, my noggin um, safe, and it's also super cute, so I love that. And then, let me see, these are my knee pads, um, so they just go on, on top of my knees, and if I fall, I fall on my knee pads, so I don't, um, you know, fall on anything else and get hurt. These are my wrist pads, or my wrist guards. Um, so you just stick your thumb through, and then you wrap it all the way around, like that. And you just Velcro it down on the back. And then if you fall, you fall right on here, and you don't hurt your wrist. Which is super important, because I think when people fall, it's their instincts to try to catch themselves. Um, so you know, having wrist pads is really important when you are going to fall. And then I also have these elbow pads. So those just go right, right here, protect my elbows. I don't wear these a ton. I don't really fall on my elbows very much, but you never know. So these I use for roller derby. These I use for roller derby. And then my roller derby knee pads are a lot bigger. Um, so as you guys can see, these are a lot more oops, heavy duty than these. The padding difference is crazy. This is like three times thicker than this is. Because um, in roller derby, you're taking a lot of falls and they're usually pretty hard. So this is, as you can see, it's like three or four inches thick. So this is really going to protect my knees. Um, so that's what I use for roller derby. And then, as you guys saw on my on my trail skates and my 
um, the first skates that I showed you guys, I had pink wheels and those are like harder wheels. So I use those at the skate park and at the roller skating rink. But when I go outside, I use these gummy, they're a little bit bigger and they're like, they're a lot cushionier. So when I go over rocks, um, I don't trip because if I went over rocks in my really hard ones, I would it would completely stop my wheel and I would go falling forward. And these are kind of like tires on a car and they kind of just take everything underneath them and they're just super awesome with going over rocks and stuff. So this is kind of my wheel bag. It has all of my skate tools in it so I can change my wheels and stuff. Um, so now that you guys have learned all about skates, I am going to show you guys a couple videos of me roller skating. So I hope you guys enjoy it. Here they are. And I'll see you guys for another video sometime. Bye.